Hello, today is going to be a quick one from me. It's day 11. Um, I'm come down to the kitchen to get some snacks ready because Saturday is generally my day off. It's a day I have with the boys, so we had a really, really good day today. Um, it's been like we've been active but also been quite chilled, which has been really, really nice. I started work on a website yesterday for Living Designedly, so I'm going to share. The next time I work on it, I'll share the, the stuff that I'm doing on there, uh, the kind of information I'm going to try and put on there that I think will be relevant to start with, bearing in mind that, that there's no products or services yet. Um, but I'm using Wix, which I find so, so easy, and I'll kind of explain that a bit more as well, I think. Um, and I think one of the things I did today, and it's something I've been doing for a while, actually, but I've not necessarily put it on here yet, but I do think it's a part of my living designedly. Um, and I discovered this person, I, I can't even remember when it was or how, but his name is Wim Hof, and you might have seen him, he's from Holland, so that's always a good bonus, because that's where I'm from too. Um, and he, he is just amazing, absolutely incredible. Like, you need to go and just YouTube whatever, you'll find him. Um, his whole practice around this cold therapy and breathing exercises it's phenomenal how he's kind of proven through research and science the, the impact it can have. And I find it so fascinating. And it's something that the cold shower bit is the bit I've been implementing more and more into my, my own showers. So when I have a shower, I finish it with a cold shower. And it's not always for that long. And I've got to say, this was so much easier when it was warm. <laughs> Now that it's getting cold outside, it's co it feels so much colder. Um, but I did it this morning, washed my hair, um, and literally just let the cold run over. And it's all about mindset, and I think this is another story I've definitely got to talk about. The whole mindset aspect for me changed dramatically when I um, had Joshua on the 12th of May this year, 2020. Which is the day after my birthday, by the way. So I'm glad it wasn't on my birthday, because that's not something you want to be doing. Um, so yeah, I think that's definitely a story around mindset that I need to tell, because my whole idea of that changed completely through my mindset um, during birth, like giving birth. And Wim Hof is just really, really incredible what he's done, what the message that he's putting out there. Um, and the like I said, the cold shower is just an easy part of my routine to add to kind of add to that living design of the element for me because the shower is something you do already anyway and just finishing it with a cold one just it just takes determination and mindset because you can do it because you're already in there um and that's something else I talk a lot about um or have talked a lot about recently with the members and clients I've been working with is habit tagging so if you want to add a new habit into your life, rather than saying, I'm going to eat healthier or I'm going to floss my teeth, I'm going to have cold showers, I'm going to meditate, rather than leaving it quite broad, if you tag it onto a current habit that is already set as part of your patterns and behaviours, it makes that a lot easier. So if you're saying you want to floss more, then you do it, you say like, after I brush my teeth, I'm going to floss. So after, once I've had a shower, I'm going to finish it with a cold shower. Um, after I've had my morning coffee, I'm going to meditate. So you add it to something that you're already doing regularly and it's more likely to stick. Um, yeah, so that's my cold shower. I will, I, will, I will do one as a video, obviously not me in the shower. <laughs> but that the process, definitely go check out Wim Hof, absolutely amazing. Um, and there's more in my health part of Living Designly for my life that I'm going to be adding in um, as we go on this journey. And there's more and more to come. So really excited to share that with you. This is still a four and a half minute video. I'm sorry. I'm going. I'm going to watch a film. Um, good night. See you tomorrow.